Okay then, Louis. So taking a look at these two setups now, as we can see on the left hand side, this is kind of your before. Quite a really, really sort of tilted over posture. Legs very sort of straight out there. And just as I said, because the arms then were forced to kind of move inwards towards your body there. Just a slightly awkward way to swing the goal club. In fairness to yourself, you did strike the golf ball well from this position on occasions, but it was very, very inconsistent, to be fair. So an inability to rotate as effectively. Gets a lot of leg work in there. Arms doing a lot of lifting and trying to get that goal club now to the top of the back swing. Very, very high with that right elbow and left arm lifting up quite a lot. So just try to feel a little bit more relaxed in there. Again, still getting a nice straight back, but just feeling there's a little bit of flex in the knees now, getting those arms to sort of hang down a bit more vertically from the shoulders. Like I said, we could possibly go a little bit further away here, but in reality, if we moved any further away from where you were to that new position, it already felt strange moving that small amount there. So going more now at this current stage would probably be too much. So we're going to gradually move back there bit by bit, going through the sort of couple more lessons that you've got available on that voucher. So from that better setup, as we said, just able to turn and rotate a little bit more. Your arms have still got that sort of stretching tendency. That's just something you've obviously instinctively done. But in time, you'll sort of realise from a sort of more neutral posture, you won't need to do quite so much kind of lifting and stretching to get that backswing. But for me, through the ball, a much better kind of release now with the body. As we see the club here now, as we come through, that left elbow down now a little bit more and not so protruding out. Compare that to this one here now as we go through. You can see the same sort of position, that left elbow a little bit higher, sticking out a little bit. And then the follow through sort of quite kind of holding off here now again, very high left elbow club here across your head whereas this one because of that better release and the relaxed arms and the tension being taken out now the arms now finish a little bit more around your head club there sort of through the back of your head then a much more relaxed natural fashion as we can see ball then flying kind of towards target and starting at a bit of right to left shape on that goal ball. and that's going to be very good because if we can get that shape now with the seven eight six on that you were using that same practice and sort of same swing is going to translate into your driver swing. So rather than seeing your driver kind of veering off, off to the right this way, it's going to start flying a lot straighter once you get more consistent with this sort of mid to short iron. So work at that setup with the shorter irons. Get some confidence in terms of where that ball is in relation to you. As we said, when you first made this adjustment, you felt very much further from the ball. Obviously, your spine is not so much tilted as it was before. So You've got to readjust for that. Just be careful. Make sure you do stand a little bit further from the board. You can sort of see on here now where you were originally. As you mentioned this video, just to stand back a little bit. You can see how much you sort of move back now. Your feet kind of just shuffle back there just a little bit. Could you go back a bit more? Yeah, possibly. But really speaking, I say small little adjustments bit by bit by bit. It definitely can make it a lot easier if you sort of still feel comfortable while making that change progressively. So get down the driving range. Get some swings under your belt there. Work on that new setup. And please feel free to send some videos through uh, from your practice session. Let me know how it's going and sort of send me some feedback. And if you send some videos looking sort of at this view down the line, I can sort of check out and see where you're at with that posture and that new setup. Just make sure we're doing the right thing. So like I said, hope it all makes sense. Any questions, obviously give me a shout and I'll see you up next lesson. Cheers, buddy.